Cook County Commissioner Richard Boykin wants the United Nations to step in and send peacekeeping troops to Chicago to help stave off daily violence. Commissioner Boykin says Chicago needs international help with horrific levels of shooting on the west and south sides of Chicago. He doesn't understand the implications of what he's asking. Once the UN gets a foothold in the United States, they won't stop at Chicago, and the Constitution goes out the window. Source, CBS Chicago. I'm hoping to appeal to the UN to actually come to Chicago and meet with victims of violence, and maybe even possibly help out in terms of peacekeeping efforts, because I think it's so critical for us to make sure that these neighborhoods are safe, Boykin said at O'Hare International Airport on Thursday. Boykin said leaders in Chicago and Cook County have failed to protect many communities from violent crime. Earlier in the year, President Trump said if things didn't change, he would send in federal agents to help fix the violence problem in the city, and top leaders got angry. Even major celebrities didn't want Trump's help, but Commissioner Boykin is trying to make a move around our commander-in-chief. Related, common response to Trump, we'll work with state, local grassroots for Chicago, no need for feds. We've been watching the violence for years, and the city leaders ask for more money with little to no results. Boykin continued there is a quiet genocide taking place in too many of our communities. 80% of those who are being killed by gun violence are African American, and often killed at the hands of another African American, he said. So we must protect these population groups, and that's what the United Nations does. They're a peacekeeping force. They know all about keeping the peace, and so we're hopeful that they'll hear our appeal. Boykin said Chicago must utilize every avenue available to protect its people from gun violence, possibly including UN peacekeepers. Again, President Trump offered a solution, but Chicago turned it down and now it seemingly has gotten worse. Related, Donald Trump threatens to send feds to Chicago. Here's another excuse to use the UN force. They've been able to help in places like Africa and abroad, where they've sent troops in and sent forces in to help protect minority and vulnerable populations, and so quite frankly I think the same can be said for here in Chicago, Boykin said. I'm talking about physical security. I'm also talking about maybe suggestions for what we can do in Chicago to help protect our minority populations. We're being, again, decimated by the violence that we see here in Chicago. I mean this is really a genocide, and we have to do something to stop it. This guy got elected to represent his community. I hope taxpayer money wasn't wasted on this trip. How about going to the communities where the violence is occurring and appealing to his constituents? How about getting all the ministers who run the storefront churches together to start a coalition to stop the violence? Comparing Chicago gun violence to genocide is pure ignorance and insulting to those countries currently experiencing genocide. Asking the UN is asinine and embarrassing. Stricter gun laws, targeting the illegal gun sale black market and police training, it not that complicated. It's simple Chicago has an incompetent mayor Rahm Emanuel always raising taxes and 642 plus homicides in the sanctuary city of Chicago because of liberal pathetic democratic policies, that's where your problem lies. Chicago is a laughing stock of the whole world. How about you get rid of gun laws, crooks don't follow laws anyway, so gun laws only hurt the righteous people. Next get the Democrats out of Chicago and stop the corruption. If you won't do that, then declare martial law and let the army get rid of the thugs. What do you think about the Chicago commissioner asking the United Nations for help? Share your opinion below in the comment section.